Somebody get some leaves. Somebody get some leaves. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator and welcome back to Craft the World. We are still uh, crafting the world with our little dwarves. I do have uh, a bed ready and a little tiny house. But my house is still really, really tiny. So I'm going to have to uh, do some things. Oh my god. And this zombie is uh, really causing some trouble. Climbing ladders? You didn't even know zombies could do that, did you? I definitely didn't. Alright, so we'll need to take this ladder apart in the, uh, in the correct way, from the top to the bottom, and then I can extend my house just a little bit. Oh, we're having some trouble over here. We're gonna need some more beds, definitely. I've got one guy who's resting up, but, uh, I got another guy that needs to now. So I'm going to, uh, give my house a little stretchings, and hopefully we won't die. Please don't let this ghost steal any of my shit. I would really appreciate that. And uh, he threw a knife out of our out of our inventory. That's fine. We're not using the knives so much anymore. Um, I should also probably build a second story to this house. I think that would be a wise thing to do. So I'm gonna rip the top off of my house. We'll rip the door off too, and the wall. House walls destroyed. Oh no! You guys, what have you done? Except, you know, exactly what I asked you to do. <laughs> That's fine. You guys are doing a good thing. And then I will uh, build some more house walls over this way. And uh, let's, let's start to uh, cut some of this wheat. We'll get the wheat, we'll get all of that done. And uh, here's a portal. They're gonna like that a lot. Oh shit. They can't get up there. Well, let's see. Let's see how it goes. My house is in the shambles. I can't get through. Oh. Well, we'll give you a little ladder. That should help you out. And then uh, I'll pull the, pull the roof off. Go on. Pull the roof off. And let's uh, get some of this all flattened out. That's gonna be real nice! And I can build uh, an even bigger house. I think that's the right thing to do. Look at how quick they go when you just give them one task to concentrate on. My goodness. I sure am proud of you little fellows. Let's uh, put another ladder on the ground floor. And uh, that portal is probably not placed very well. <laughs> They're gonna have quite a spill. Yep. See that? Every time they go through the portal, they're losing a bit of health. So that's bad. I'll need to craft some more beds. I need to make some beds, you guys. I can only make two more. I guess it'll work just fine. For now... Hmm, we need more space. Need more space for bed. Oh well. At least we got, uh... This, this fishing pond all, all ready. So we could, uh, drain it nicely. Right down the, the little hatch. I don't need to worry too much about the water and stuff like that. And I guess we need a ladder there to finish that off. Hmm. Yes, let's extend the house. Oh my. There is a goblin attack. This is not good. This is quite bad. Many, many goblins. And the camp is just over there, but uh, I don't have anybody left to uh, left to fight. Oh my god. Please, please no die. These goblins are fucking tough. I should have built some armor for my little guys. Oh my god. It's really bad. I'm not liking this at all. Okay, let's see if I can uh, craft some armor really quick. Release this fellow. And, uh, what can I do? What can I do? What can I do? I can only craft one helmet. I need more leaves. Shit. Shit on a stick. Okay, well, that's working. They're stuck on top of the tree. So, uh, I'll take that, I suppose. Hey, and I leveled up. Got another dwarf. That's gonna do quite nice. Oh my god. I need to equip that new dwarf with uh, at least something to fight the goblins. 
And uh, maybe I can give him my my axe and shit as well. We don't have enough for a stone axe and a pickaxe. So that's unfortunate. But uh, I'll do what I can for him. How about that? Very nice. I'm so worried about one of my guys dying. Oh, fuck. Not good. Not good. All right. So uh, I'm gonna have to rest my guys up, and then we can go attack the uh, the goblin horde. Oh my god, that was really a uh, a close call, I think. So um, let's do that. I can make some some sort of ladder or something. There it is, log bridge. So I'll string this along as a second story for my house. That'll do nicely. I don't know if I need that many, but I will take. How's that? Um, and then I guess they just go along here, right? Build. Wonderfully done. So hopefully, uh, that'll that'll work as as I have it planned. <laughs> I don't really know, but one can hope. That is for sure. I probably need some more walls as well. Um, need another bed. Put a bed. Curse you, little dwarves! No, don't curse you. Uh oh. I don't curse you. You're doing the best you can, and I know that. Let's uh, build some walls here. There we go. Can make it all double up, and I'm going to need to craft some more walls. It seems. Hmm. I don't have a whole lot of wood to spare. We need to get chopping on some of these trees here. But I got enough wood for now. So this will work just fine. And then, uh... Hmm. Log bridge, log bridge. It's log, log. It's better than bad. It's good! Uh, wooden hatch. I should like to build one of these as well. Just so I can uh, cover up that little hole in the floor. They don't need to go risk their lives out in the world. That's a rather good idea. Mm-hmm. If I do say so myself. There you go. Put the hatch down. And uh, this guy's going to finish building that wall. Hmm. I need some more... Some more bridges here. Everybody copacetic now? Are we happy yet? I'm definitely gonna need some more wood. Oh, and here's another book. A mage's book. Turns you <clears throat> Teaches you how to turn flies into elephants. And other magic shit. Wonderful. We're doing so great. I'm so proud of all you little, little fellows. Alright, so, um... Build wall here, build wall there. I'm gonna need some more walls as well on the top. Not enough resources in the stockpile. Dang. You guys, I need I need more uh more quickly workiness. If if that's possible. I probably didn't need to make this as high as I did, to be completely honest. So I'm gonna take these bridges back. Hmm. Yeah, I'll leave them to climb on the walls and things like that. That'll do just fine. And then, uh, I can just make a a second floor and, and put a roof on it, and everybody's going to be super happy, I think. I hope. I'm not sure. <laughs> it seems to be working okay. Should we close this? Is that possible? I don't know. I'm not really sure. I need to build some more fucking walls and things. Hmm. Nobody's gonna rest up because I don't have a, a sealed bed. This is gonna be really bad. Go chop that. Got boars over here. Oh wow, look at this giant mountain of granite. Hmm. Well, well, well. And uh, I need some ladder over here. The night is coming once more! Oh, why this? Alright. I 
guess we're uh, we're doing the best we can. That guy's gonna go collect some apples. Oh, this tree's close. Chop that one down. It's gonna do real nice. And uh, keep building. Yes, yes. Do all that I need you to do in the short time that I've allotted. There's some more walls. I think that's gonna be enough to finish off this house. I do hope. Look at how small the house was before. My god. And uh, now we're under attack again. Those goblins are gonna fucking reinforce each other tomorrow. I think I should probably destroy this camp as soon as possible. So, uh, here, do that. Is this guy gonna get hurt? I guess the Goblin Queen doesn't attack. I should probably, though, uh, put a portal here so they can carry all the shit back with ease. Hooray! Did, did you kill her? Now destroy the camp. There we go. Just so the goblins won't respawn. I don't want to take any fucking risks with that. All of my dwarves survived, but, uh... I think there was a rather, rather small chance of that happening. And uh, now we've got some skeleton soldiers marching in. I'm definitely going to need to make some, some adjustments. There we go. Everybody okay? I hope they live. They're all pretty well equipped and the skeletons seem pretty squishy. So I don't think it's going to be too bad. Kill ten skeletons! Hooray! And, uh, they've got a bunch of goodies here, so everybody's gonna take those back to the camp. I think it's gonna be real nice. And we'll, uh, cut some more stone over here. Um, need some more house. Need some more house, you guys. And, uh, my entrance is being blocked off. That's not good. Go kill the sheep as well. Hmm quite difficult, I think, but uh, we're gonna get it done, for sure, There, we'll put uh, some ladders so they can reach those points, and then uh, I think my door is a little off-center. Let's remove this door, or don't. How does it work? Okay, take the door off. <laughs> it's gonna be just fine. Did that sheep drop any wool? I need some wool. I also need lots of leaves so I can build uh, armor for my fellows. My six little fellows. They're doing so wonderfully. Cut down 30 trees. Hooray! We did a great thing here today. Um, can I build across here? I do have enough resources to do it. So that's nice. And then, uh, finish up that. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You're doing fantastic, little fellas. Stick the door on there and on there. And we will have a, a completed house once more. I think maybe I should uh, get rid of this and seal it up if it presents a problem. I'm not sure if it will or not. Hmm. Well, let's uh, build a bunch more ladders. You guys are doing wonderful. I'm so fucking proud of you. Oh, here comes the ghost. Right on cue. Welcome, Mr. Ghost. The shelter borders have been violated. Oh my god. Who violated them? Answer me! There's a bunch of other shit that I need to craft, too. Water, ore, coal. Hmm, I don't have enough iron ore quite yet. And we'll need to collect some water for the forge as well. But right now my uh, my focus is on getting this house completed. So we don't get fucking wrecked by skeletons. And then I'll uh, I'll put a second story of, of stuff here. Is that okay? Hmm. Okay, never mind it. Don't do it. I'll need to remove some uh, some ladders first, I think. Here, take these ladders down. 
we won't need them at the moment. And can they climb the walls to get to the other parts? I guess they can. You guys are doing a wonderful thing here. I just need uh, a little more. Shelter borders have been violated. Th that's what I hear. People tell me that. Oh my god. That guy ate shit. Go rest, you. It's Feely! Oh my god, Feely! If you die, your brother Keely's gonna miss you so much. I think I need buckets in order to get this water uh, scooped out. Is that right? I'm not sure. That guy's going for it. Good job, Uter. You're doing uh, a great thing here today. Here, seal it off. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get rid of this and uh, seal it up. That's a shame. But also, no problem. Remove that. House complete. See, it's going all down here, including this in my house, so... That's not gonna work for me. Go grab that thing, we'll build some earth and seal it up. Hurry, get out of the hole! <laughs> there we go. That's a nice house, isn't it? Alright, so, uh... I'll have to build a second story. I think this is gonna do just fine. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You can just get on the beds. No more monkeys jumping on the beds. And I'll put, a uh, log bridge here. Does that work? Maybe I should drop it down one more. I'm sure I'll be able to fit some beds and shit up there. Doesn't seem like it's going to present too much of a problem. Ugh, what a rush. And uh, if I need to make my house a little bigger, we'll do that. Go kill that sheep. Oh yeah, I need some armor. I need to build some, some hats and things. I've got six dwarves. I've got six leaves. I'm going to make a little hat for all of them. I think that'll be nice. Yay! And, uh, they are, like, distinguishable by their hats. Ooh! Got some new weapons, too. I like weepons. Um, I'll go ahead and stick them all with a hat. Make equipment! Hooray! And, uh, I think I got another axe or something like that, didn't I? Hmm. Yeah, there it is. Pickaxe. Well done. Oin! Oin and Gloin! It's another, uh, Lord of the Rings reference. So happy. It makes me so happy. I think I can fit all of these guys with a, at least a helmet, and hopefully that'll help just a little bit with the, uh, the beating of the skeletons. Well, now they've all got, uh, the same hat, which makes me a little bit sad. But alright. I guess it'll do for now. Why does, why does, uh, Drong not look like he has the hat on? Would you wear the hat for me, please? I guess he won't. He does what he wants. Alright. Fuck it. <laughs> I need some more, uh, beds, I think. I've got three beds. I need to make just a couple more. But I ran out of leaves, that's right. Damn. Let's make a table, how about... I'll put some food on the table, and then they'll be able to, uh, eat and drink and be merry, as dwarves are wont to do, you know? Um, let's see. I think I just need one. I'll make two. Why not? And then, uh, place. Place it there. Just so. Hmm. I think this is going quite well. And we got some wool over there now. If anybody would care to grab that. Oh, we can fit both tables. I'll put them both there. And then we need some more leaves. Somebody get some leaves! Somebody get some leaves! Here, we'll do this. And then we could kill some sheeps over here. I'll make a portal. A boosh. There you go. Little fellas. Do your job. And unfortunately, I, uh, killed the fish that were in this pond, but it had to be done, don't you see? You must understand. Alright. Seem to be doing some good work over here. 
to kill this chicken. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Kill the chicken, kill the sheeps. You can kill the sheeps anytime you're ready. They're just sitting there. Oh, and then we also got the Grunt's Shop. I've got a few, uh, coins. Four, to be exact. What do I need? Hmm, gold ore? Ooh! Mithril ore. Dang. I really need some wool so I can make backpacks for my little fellows. But, uh, it's not gonna happen quite yet. Not yet. Oh, they're having a good nap. Are you, are you enjoying yourself there? Yeah. Maybe that's why he doesn't wear his hat. He can't wear it while he's napping. That just don't make no sense. So hopefully we're getting a good amount of leaves from this stuff. I can't say for sure. And uh, we'll dig dig this out a little bit so uh, we can kill that sheep, hopefully. Kill him. Kill both the sheeps. I require. Yeah. I need the wood. I need the wood real bad. What else? What else? We got some eggs, some berries. I should probably uh, load up the the tables with berries and apples. Ooh, mixed green salad. Well, why did nobody tell me about this? Improved portal. Need gold ore, silver ore. Hmm, and planks. Interesting. Leather. We're not sure how to make. I could make a a bit of a bit of rope. I guess that's a good thing. I should probably buy some. Let's just buy some more wool. What else am I going to use these coins for? Thank you so much. And uh, a bit more rope, if you please. Oops, that's that's not the wool. Oh, I guess they just drop it. Drop it on the floor, and you guys got to carry it back to base. Fine. Here, more portal. You can never use too much magic. Oh, that's right, I was also going to load up the tables. Here you go. Does that make you nice and happy? Maybe I should make one more table. I want them to be uh, so satisfied with their life. Yes. Make another. Hey, and we finished the uh, basic furnishing. So now we can start cooking a little bit. Got advanced woodworking. I can make a wood bench. There's the bucket that I was looking for. Excellent. I'll need to make some more armor in order to get to the uh, basic weaponry. And I still haven't even started on advanced ironworking because I need that fucking forge to make basically anything. So, uh, I'll do what I can. That much, I can promise you. I'm so proud of my little dwarves! They're doing so good! <sighs> Alright. Wonderfully done. Put the table down. I'll, uh, put some more, some more foodies on it for ya. That's what they seem to like. Ooh, you can make grilled meats, fried eggs. Hmm, I guess we'll need to find some more eggs. I'll put some cones on the table. Do you guys eat pine cones? They're dwarves. They eat fucking everything. Oh, make some food. Okay. The dwarves will take the food on their own when they are hungry. Wonderful. That's working out quite well. And uh, are we still over here doing stuff? Yes, we are. Um, what do I need? Rope. Rope, rope, rope. I need to make some... There we go. Twelve pieces of rope. Awesome. So, I completed the basic armor without uh, really meaning to. Oh, but I need to complete iron working before I can get into uh, processing and basic weaponry. That's troubling. How do I make a cooking campfire? Take a pot. I got a pot. Take some charcoal. I got some charcoal. And then a little bit of wood. It says here his teeth were made of wood. Wool. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Fuck that one up. Here, let's uh let's make some cooking pots. Somebody's gonna get get their cooking on. Um, put it here. I don't know. I guess we only need one. Doesn't make too much sense to have more than that, does it? Uh-uh. Ah, <sighs> and the zombies are coming. 
Please find out in the next episode if we do survive, friends. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I thank you so much for watching, and please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. And if you do, friends, I'll send you the top of a thermos. Uh, I don't know where the rest of the thermos went. It's, it's gone forever. I think the dwarves probably took it for their cooking pot needs. Anyways, <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Thanks again for watching. This has been Craft the World, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then... Bye bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye. See you again. Goodbye, goodbye. See you, my friends. <laughs>